All right, today's video is going to be a tutorial on how to find the sweet spot on a canvas when you're using color. Um, we already got this canvas marked out in three different sections. We're going to use three different colors just to show you how to find that sweet spot. The first color that we're going to be laying down is a red. So here we go. Got our red down. We're going to wait for that dry and then we're going to come back and hit it with the next color. Okay, what we have loaded in to light burn is a power test for Otora laser. Um, and this test right here has 10 different blocks and the 10 blocks have power levels from 10 all the way to 100. It also has D3 and it has grayscale. If you look over here in the cuts and layers, all of it has different colors so this this just separates each burn so blue which is 10 percent that's how much power it's going to get and so on um all of the speed is 3000 that's the speed i i burn with personally on all canvas but this is what we're going to use on each color on that canvas to figure out where's the sweet spot you know the sweet spot is where we're gonna burn our next canvas we're going to choose that block either it's going to be 60 70 50 wherever it at wherever we get the best color on our canvas that's how you select the power that you're going to be using for that canvas no matter if it's red white blue black orange purple green any color that you can think of this is how you find that okay now we're back that first coat was a rust-oleum red gloss now we're going to put down a rust-oleum white gloss this is a, a recycled canvas you know it was it was ruined before I took it I painted it a couple of coats of white and next thing you know we can reuse it as a test you can always reuse them as practice since we laid that white down that's a small area We'll go ahead and lay down a coat of this blue. Alright. Kind of went over into the white a little bit, but it'll be alright. We'll still be able to get what we're looking for. So, we're going to wait till this dry. We're going to throw a black coat over the top of it. And then we're going to put it on the laser and do a power test. And we're going to run our scan from 10% power all the way to 100% power. And it will tell us exactly what we need to set our power at in light burn when we're burning our canvas to whatever result we want, whatever color we want. If we want a pink, we want a, we want a dark red, we want a light red, or we want a dark blue, we want a light blue. Now this canvas right here was already prepped with one coat of white rust-oleum paint, high gloss. Alright, and then we put the red, we put the coat of regular white, no high gloss, just regular gloss, and then we put a coat of uh, Rust-Oleum Gloss Blue. So, we're going to wait on it to dry, put a coat of black over the top of it, and then we're going to go ahead and start the burn. Alright, our canvas has dried, we're ready to start. The first color we're going to do is the Gloss Red Rust-Oleum, we're going to hit Shift and Frame. To make sure we're inside of the borders and we are so we're going to go ahead and hit start to see what power setting we're going to use when we're trying to get whatever color we
All right, so we're done, ran it. I'll take a handy dandy foam brush. This is what I use to clean all of my canvases after I burn, just to brush away all the ash and anything that might be left over. And take it, brush all everything off. And that's how you decide where you want to be at. So 60, 60 is pretty good. But if you're using D3, you want to be somewhere in the middle. So me, I go 65, somewhere in that area. Somewhere in this area right here, that's where I want to be at. That's how you figure out. Y'all stick around, we're going to do the other colors to figure out, you know, where you want to be at when you're doing canvas with color. And this is how you check where you want to be at. The sweet spot. Okay, we're back. Now we're going to do the white section just to see if we can find a sweet spot. Now we're done trying to find a sweet spot for white. What we do is take our foam brush, brush away any access that might have been there. And you can see right in between maybe here. So 65, 70, 70 ish. Looks pretty good. So this is how you find the sweet spot. Just just look. Look at your D3 your grayscale see where you want to be at okay now we're going to do the blue section we got everything lined up and go ahead and start it try to find a sweet spot <laughs> 